week been practice or? Um, just like every other week, we go get the game plan, practice it, and try to execute it throughout practice, and just focusing on their offensive players. Is there a different feeling with the defense this year from, say, last year or the year before? Um, I guess you could say so because I feel like it's like last year it felt like a family, but now I feel like everybody is trying to help each other each and every day. So it's like even more of a family, like a stronger brother relationship. And that translates to the field. Yeah, so I feel like it helps. Like we help the linebackers, the linebackers help the DBs, and it's like we also look out for the DBs and stuff by putting pressure on the quarterback, and they get picks and a lot. Of, so I feel like it ex- we it affects to the field too, just like in practice and stuff. So when you force an interception, do they give you the belt? Oh, uh, nah. <laughs> <laughs> I wish it worked like that. I mean, what are some of the things that you've seen or that seen and or heard about their running back? What are some of the things that you guys are keying on just to slow him down? Um, his run, their running back is pretty much like a downhill type running back, uh, like an SEC back. Um, if you don't wrap him up, he's going to break your arm tackle. So you have to put your body into the tackles and stuff like that. But he's a hard runner. How do you guys? How do you rate the way you guys have done forcing fumbles at this point? Um, I feel like we did an okay job so far. I feel like we could always do better. So we've been trying to execute that and practice a lot more and focusing on that a lot. I know you guys have goals that you said, but you've been so good this year at batting passes. Do you, have, do you enter each game with like a goal for batting passes? Uh, yeah, I always try to get at least two a game, but if I can, I just want to put pressure on the quarterback as much as possible. With this week and being a little bit more of a quicker passing team, mm-hmm. what, how does that change with your key? Um, it pretty much, you got to expect the cut blocks a lot more since they are so quick at releasing the ball and stuff, and you just have to get your hands up and try to at least bat a couple of them more. What do you see from the offense? Um, they like to slide a lot in the offense. Uh, the center calls all the slides and protections and stuff like that. So uh, they're a pretty good unit. They played with each other like before, and um, they got a pretty good offensive front. What about just their offense as a whole? How good is their offense look on the Um, they're pretty explosive. So at any point in the game, they could come up with a big play. So you have to be aware of the uh, the small things. How many times have you heard anyone in meetings or practice say fifty nine to nothing this week? Uh, none. What kind of where have you seen? Darren kind of make the most strides since he first got here? Um, I say a converting pass rush because um, he was struggling with it through the beginning of camp and stuff like that, but now he's starting to get in the hang of it and balancing up the rush lanes and stuff like that. I know, obviously, he's kind of taken the, the starting spot at, at the nose guard, but what, what's that relationship like with him? Because you know, you're obviously getting plenty of reps as well. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a good relationship. Uh, I try to help them get better and critique them every day in practice if I see something wrong. And like they come after me and help me get better too. So it's just like a brother-brother relationship and we just all try to help each other get better. OJ said that uh, when you guys are flying to from these games, the focus is on sort of keeping your mind right and relaxing. How do you do that on the flight? Um, I probably listen to music. Uh, sometimes if it's a long flight, I take a nap. Uh, or I look over like, I'll look on my iPad and watch film and stuff like that to keep in mind on the schemes and stuff like that so I won't forget anything. Are you okay with flying? No, I don't have a problem with it now. Okay. <laughs> anyone, like, anyone like Blake Simmons last year, any nervous flyers? Uh, I don't think so this year. I can't think of any right now. Were you a nervous flyer? You said now. Uh, freshman year I was, yeah. <laughs> Did you ever fly before you came here? Um, I don't think so. This was my like, first time pretty much flying when I got here. When you, yep. oh, go when you get a bad pass, what's it like adrenaline-wise knowing you did that? Uh, it's, you get excited for it when it happens, but when you get to the sideline, you start to feel a little bit. Yeah. And say that it hurt? Uh, some of them, yeah. <laughs> what's, what's the ideal spot to hit? Um, pretty much you want to hit it in your palm, but sometimes it hits you like in the wrist or forearm or might get a fingertip or something like that. You, you feel it in certain places more than others. Jake threw that one. Hmm? Jake threw that one. Uh, nah. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, he did. Yeah. <laughs> Anything else? Thanks, Dad. Thanks, Dad.